they were parting shots. Four years ago, as emigration from Ireland reached the highest level since the 1980s, David Monaghan began taking nighttime portraits of the people who were leaving. Initially, the project was born out of the sadness of the return of um, migration. Such was the response to the project, David embarked on a second series of photographs. This is uh, Bernard in London. As he visited participants in their new homes around the world. Hugely, hugely interesting experience. A final series of photographs has seen David return at dawn to the locations which were backdrops to the original portraits. The purpose of making that shot on the, on the second second pass was to just consider the space as an empty space and uh, see what it looked like with actually nobody in it. Gone but not forgotten. Hello. David developed friendships with Hi, many Jim. of his sitters, well, such as Sarah, who's now in San Francisco. We're kind of feeling the tug. It's, a, it's around a year since we've been home last. Sarah's experience of emigration, as well as the photographs of the 84 people who participated in the four-year project, are brought together in a new book. I suppose the book is a, an act of addressing history, I suppose, and trying to actually have um, some sort of effect on the documentation of that, and um, perhaps throwing a bit more light on the subject. David believes many of the people he photographed have left Ireland for good. His unique take on contemporary Irish immigration is also a tale that's been told many times before. Philip Bromwell, RTE News, Dublin.